Hello and welcome to Arca at Las Vegas. It's been a while for me, and I have an explanation. <laughs> um, so, I took a small break. Emphasis on small. Um, just real life stuff. Getting in my way from racing. And then, when I tried to come back and do some, it was, I believe... Uh, the truck race at Charlotte, however many weeks ago, one week, one and a half, I don't know. And long story short, after a very hard struggle and getting to about 10 laps to go, feeling accomplished because of overcoming a setup that wasn't working for me too well, I lost internet connection and got super discouraged. So then I took another short break. And on top of that, life stuff getting in my way. Well, not getting in the way, just doing okay. other things. Uh, it's been a while since I've been able to race on recording. I've uh, I've done some racing. Just uh, hold on, it's really loose. Um, just haven't recorded it. Um, particularly after the re losing recordings, just feeling discouraged. But, uh, have been able to do a little bit of racing, not as much. I missed Arca at Gateway last week, which is kind of a bummer. But, it's, uh, is what it is. Currently, trying not to get loose. <laughs> I did, though. Just a tiny bit. I think that was still okay. Kind of killed my runoff, but, um, then I did two races more recently. They were pretty good. I was happy with the recordings, and then I find out that my microphone didn't record them. So there went two more races. Um, so that stunk. So hopefully this one's actually working. <laughs> so that's why it's been like two weeks. Haven't been racing as much. Lost three recordings in a row because of a mix of internet loss and microphone not working <laughs> and so I've been trying but haven't had the time or the luck apparently so that's what's gone on there like I said though still been doing a little bit of racing I've been doing some Xfinity be open and uh, always try to do my rookie road races and I've done a couple of these so far already. Arca at Las Vegas. First attempt uh, was actually pretty strong strength of field. Yeah, I finished seventh with no, with no crashing, which was good. That was one that uh, got lost because of no microphone. And then a couple late night ones where I finished. Was it a couple late night ones? Maybe just one. I think I did one more race, maybe. And uh, that was a pretty good battle. I wish I had recorded that one, but I just wasn't feeling up to it because it was late at night. Very low strength of field. And was discouraged. <laughs> but it ended up being a pretty good battle. Um, started third and then um, fought hard with the guy that started second or first. I think the guy that started first and ended up winning but he was coming fast <laughs> at the end, so it was pretty intense. So hopefully we'll have another good race here. Um, that 651 I hit on the first lap there, I'm pretty sure that was an all-time best, and it still dropped me to fourth, so I can't quite do what some of these other guys are doing, particularly like the number nine there, getting a 30.4. I've, I've been seeing guys hit 30.4s, and I'm like, how? How are you doing that? Because... I can, I can power through these corners pretty well, but I, I can't quite just flat foot it like I think some guys might be able to. Like, I'm try, I have to lift a little bit, just a little bit to get the thing uh, steady. And even still, I got a little loose, like on the second lap, as you saw. So, uh, oh, back to fifth now. So, dropping a little bit. I am the number one car, as you see, which I was surprised, because I think we had, like, 
hundred people signed up or something. But I guess, uh, I guess I still ended up being the high, highest die rating at 4,500 or something like, right, like that right now on Oval. Hopefully we'll have a good a good run here. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and try to get some track position early on. That seems to be the way to go. And then start worrying about saving tires and everything. 97.95. Really? My right rear got worn out. I was just going full throttle there. Is saving tires actually making things worse? <laughs> I haven't had the right rear wear more than the right front. But look at that. If I just go for it and stay on the right rear, would that actually be good for me? Or am I going to overdrive it with this new revelation and ruin my race? <laughs> interesting, interesting. One left to green. Line up on the inside. Uh, Pit road is closed right now. Either way, still, I'm gonna start off and um, try to try to be a little aggressive, which might be scary here for a minute, especially if guys are gonna be getting loose and everything, including myself. So, gonna do that. Hmm. I guess we'll see how I feel once I get farther into this race terms of whether I'm really going to try to go fast and all that, that was, you know, I'm thinking maybe that's not a good idea because even though I was wearing the right rear early on when it was loose, I think it'll probably switch over and start wearing that right front as both tires get worn and then you're not going to want to be going so hard anymore. So maybe that actually kind of fits with my strategy anyway. Go fast off the start, stay on that right rear, get some track position. And adjusting my chair doesn't feel right. Uh, get some track position, maybe uh, maybe that'll be the right way to do it anyway. Got like a John Andretti, Christian Fittipaldi <laughs> number two car in front of us. That's a fun scheme. I always liked those old, what is it, like General Mills? cars. Anyway. We'll see how it goes here. I've been torn on first gear start and second gear start. I think it's going to be second gear though. It seems like you just hit that limiter too quickly. But now you get a nice little launch. So we're going to do second gear start. <clears throat> and hopefully you'll be able to get a good view of the Sitco pole sitter and get a good good launch 12 car had a great uh, qualifying run P2 there and I guess I'll just try to stay in the top five for this race that'll be my goal keep it in the top five about to go green stay focused Uh, <laughs> I couldn't see him. Green flag, green flag. I really couldn't see him. He kind of like hid behind General Mills over there. <laughs> Keep blood. Keep blood. Clear. Ooh. Scary, man. Driving this loose race car. So, trying to move forward, like I said early on. Worry about tire saving later, probably. rear as much as possible. Oh, 
Check up the bed here. Three got stuck behind Christian Fittipaldi over here. <laughs> Go for it. Alright. It's fighting hard on the outside. Ooh, this is intense. This is fun, though. Turn down on me. Ooh, loose down here. Alright. So he was going for the lead. Interesting. Oh boy. This is scary. We're like inches from each other. Kind of trying to get that rotation on entry. Staying on the throttle a little longer and letting it basically get sideways into the corner. Oh, three's coming back. Bang. Two's basically sideways. Oh! Well, the leader's getting loose. Wow, we're going hard. This is crazy. Run off the high side. Loose. That's the way I like it. Second line here. All right. Oh my gosh, it's only lap nine. I feel like I've lived a lifetime. I'm easy in the corner now. Not gonna die below the apron. Try to get a run on him. Not quite. So turn into the corner. Interesting. <laughs> I did not expect him to take that path. So, um, I haven't really saved tires at all. That's probably going to hurt me later. Oh my gosh, he's diving it in there. He almost hit him. He might have hit him. Yikes, he put his nose where it did not belong, and he basically drifted up and nearly took him out. Wow. That was super aggressive. Again on the high side. We've gotten to the point where uh, 
passing is going to be more difficult. This is why I wanted the track position. Got the 23 coming up. Was he always there? Am I losing my mind? I don't feel like I noticed the 23 here. <laughs> if he was here all along. But, interesting. I think I'm going to regret driving so hard off the start, though. I, I wanted to drive hard off the start, but I, that lasted a little longer than I wanted to just because I was uh, trying to get in front of guys. Like, rotate on entry. Car tends to get loose later in the run, so maybe it's a good thing that I was harder on the right front early on. Maybe it'll be more even later. I don't know. Ah, my latency is not doing great again. I hate that. That's been pretty bad lately. 23. I guess they're tires or something, because they're coming. The car inside, a black was in the top point nine. Clear inside. Think about just letting them go. In fact, I don't know if I have a choice. Wow. They're really sticking it down there. Clear inside. This is what we're gonna do. We are gonna file in behind them. Oof. Got to keep it low on the track. Not let this guy get the nose on me. And... 23 is taking a really easy into the corner, which... I think he's going to get really loose later on. Which, maybe he can handle that. Maybe that's going to do him well, but... I don't know. It's really interesting. There's lots of different ways to approach these races. this race combo here. It's nice having his draft, even though the draft is very weak in the Arca car. It's nice to have. Nine still up by the wall. It's given him a, a really good run off. He seems to be doing pretty well with it. I could get, end up fighting up there. I think the three over drove the corner or something, and I was watching him and got loose. Dang. Pay attention to my own race. And nine's shown he's willing to be aggressive, so that is a little bit concerning if he starts fighting, uh... Oof, the leader there. Looked like the leader got loose. So we might have to watch out. Oh, they're both taking the high line. Number two took his high line away from him. That's funny. Cars get loose now. Drifted through that corner. All right, good to know. Shout out to that 23. He is killing it. I was bad. My tires always don't feel good at all. I think this three might end up around me. Oh, he's trying to slide job him. He basically runs into him. That <laughs> nine is being so aggressive. A4. 
Trying to run that middle line in one two now. As this car has gotten looser. I think that really hurt that nine doing that crazy like slide job thing. <laughs> got too low and I got loose again. Not doing a great job of handling it this time. I feel like that last race that I won here, I did a much better job of managing the feel of the car and staying on top of how it was going to change next. Here I feel like I went so hard at the start, it's just kind of all over the place. We're losing some distance to the guys ahead. Three's using the higher line. Yeah, I, I've, I've completely killed this car. It does not feel good at all. Shoot. Loose. Is that the leader getting loose too? I think the leader slid enough to where they had smoke coming out. Oh my gosh, they're all over the place. What's going on? I did not... This guy to my outside, he's gonna pass me now. Still there, hold your line. You're gone a lot, or if that matters to you. Keep low. <sighs> Shoot, Stay man. Low. It's intense racing, that's for sure. The outside, clear. He's gonna clear me, or he already did. <laughs> My line's working for him pretty darn well. Still there, hold your line. Still there, hold your line. There it was, it didn't really there, did it? Still there, hold your line. Still there. We've been taking three more to break die. Okay, nope. <laughs> Not today, demons. He's really close to our left side. He did not give us any room at all. This race is crazy, man. We're on the high line now, because of course we are. <laughs> this is so intense, I feel like I can't say anything. Oh, man. Oh, a 12's back. <laughs> I've done such a horrible job saving my tires this whole race, but it's been pretty darn fun, so I don't even regret anything. Keep 
right. Still there. <sighs> yeah, I don't think that bottom line's working anymore. Keep low. Stay low. Clear outside if you want it. Car outside. Keep low. We're falling down hard. Still there, hold your Definitely killed the tires. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. So tight right now. Oh, six gonna lose. We got a million people ready to pass us now. Huh. I mean, lucky get a top ten at this point. Uh, I'd expect that guy to get on my outside and they lift off. Fall all the way back to ninth. Oh, John Andretti slash Christian Fittipaldi was in the wall. Great race though, by the way. Like, everyone's super close and there hasn't been any major wrecks I've seen so far yet. I mean, it's probably going to happen now that I said that, but... Jesus. There's about five cars. There it is, there it is, we're dying. Oh god. White flag. One more to go. Car inside. Oh. Still there. I had to dodge and then who even knows what's going on anymore. Oh my god. I don't know why you race like that six for like nothing, dude. I mean we're racing like for a top five and top three or ten, dude. Uh, wow. Good job. Well, we did poorly. Did not get my top five, but that was fun. Whew, that was crazy. So, that was my worst finish yet, but it's going to be the one on recording. Because <laughs> I just tried to go hard that time and see if it worked out, and it did not. But, sure was pretty fun. <laughs> like, I came up and got me no We still got the Zero X. Blinking all over the place. Barely edged him out. I had to take every inch, though. He wasn't even there at the end of the race. Ghost hitting me, <laughs> running into me. Wow. So we got ourselves an eighth. That was not good. Tire's gonna be nuclear. 44 56. Yeah, that's horrible. <laughs> but uh, sometimes you just gotta go for it and have a fun time. <laughs> I guess. Anyway, let's uh, see what happened out here. See what caused that wreck that we had to avoid. Team getting loose on lap one. That guy reacted and got loose. On these cold tires. Where did 23 end up? Second. Fantastic race by them. That's the number 23. Just get a little bit of blinking there. It's four going to be blinking as they were the whole race. Can't see a lot of them, unfortunately. Some safer barrier on entry. Ooh, 16's nearly spinning. In front of that guy. 13's in the wall hard. That's a broken car. Twenty three and three. I think that's just a pretend wall hit on entry. Looks like it's gonna happen again. Ooh, actually did get the right rear just a tiny bit. Oof. That's a pretty good hit, and that guy ends up beating us. 
That's how hard we fell off. <laughs> blinking, blinking. 16. Under the wall. Got tight on him. 14, really loose and then overcorrects, and that's a broken car too. M.R. Hamlet. Interesting name. 11. Man, that turned three entries. Getting a lot of people, though that would look like a prediction code. It's a blinking, let's race too. I probably was at one point, knowing my internet. Oof. 3. Blinking. Blinking probably, blinking probably. This is going to be wall and exit. It's nothing, I guess. Interesting. What happened to me? Probably getting 50% on tires. It's probably right about when I did it, too. That's not good. Expected anything other than leaking there. Oh, here's the whenever the two got in the wall. Where'd they end up? Third still. Didn't matter. <laughs> Thanks in large part to the wreck that ends up happening here. Three just runs over the six. Wow. That is not necessary. Why do you do that? <laughs> so it looks like it starts off. Is it because he's not happy with the slide job? It wasn't even particularly close. I don't know why he would be upset about it, but I mean, it happened in real life with Jeb Burton and uh, Noah Gregson. Noah Gregson did a pretty standard slide job, and then Jeb Burton got really mad about it. So the three here represents Jeb Burton, and the six represents Noah Gregson, I guess. And then that causes a wreck. Three just, I think, had no interest in not running him over. Oh, maybe he felt there was blocking going on? That probably didn't help. Yeah, looks like, look, he's blocking him. Yeah. So. Hits them. Ten gets a big part of it. And then I know the 15's down there. And so what I do is I'm like, I have to get as close to the wall as possible, or else he's going to slide up at the track and hit me. So, I come up here, and 15 was able to gather up better than I thought, and unfortunately, me entering from that angle was not able to make the corner. I thought the 15 for sure was going to have to use almost the entire track, so I figured I had to be all the way up here. And I tried to make it work, but believe it or not, you're not usually turning right, right there. So, fortunately, I get in the wall. And uh, that causes me a, costs me at least one position. Eleven really took advantage of that whole deal. And uh, my tires are so dead at this point. I'm just you can see <laughs> I'm just rubbing them off the whole corner. And uh, thankfully I get enough run off the high side to be able to pass the four there, even though he comes up and gets me. But still zero x, so we're fine. So not uh, not the finish I wanted, but it was a fun race. Uh, presumably that's it. Yeah. So, um, hopefully the microphone recorded and I don't get hit by a meteor and this recording actually goes up because it's been a while and I want to upload something. So I appreciate you watching. Uh, even if it wasn't the best effort, still got ourselves a top 10 is what it is. Probably lost a little bit of eye rating, but who cares? Cause that was a fun race. Uh, hope you have a good rest of your day and I will hopefully see you sooner than two weeks this time. <laughs> See ya.